Chief Secretary Carrie Lam, Secretary for Development Paul Chan, and Secretary for Home Affairs Lao Kong Wah visited Kun Tong Mansion today to check on its renovation work. The 50-year-old building was given a new lease of life using subsidies granted under Operation Building Bright, a scheme which helps owners carry out building repair and maintenance work. Mrs. Lam noted that the scheme not only helps improve building safety, but creates new jobs. This program has been extremely effective. Um, in terms of job creation, um, some 48,700 jobs have been created, and as a result, the unemployment rate has dropped significantly to merely over 4% now. As far as the number of buildings that have been assisted, uh, the program has helped uh, some 3,000 old buildings to undergo those major repairs that we have seen today at this uh, particular building, uh, which, is over, which is exactly 50 years old. Mr. Chan, meanwhile, said the government attaches great importance to the community's concerns about suspected bid rigging for some building maintenance projects. He stressed that the Urban Renewal Authority and Housing Society have strived to assist property owners in minimizing the risk of bid rigging in recent years. The Urban Renewal Authority and the Hong Kong Housing Society have been extending assistances to public building owners in their repairs and maintenance works for the buildings, uh, including uh, introducing a tendering process to ensure the tendering process is open, transparent, fair and competitive. While Mr Lau highlighted that the Home Affairs Department has been actively collaborating with relevant departments, organizations and professional institutions to launch publicity and educational programs in 18 districts to provide information to owners' corporations and property owners on building management and maintenance.